Hello, my name is Dan Morad, um, and I'm the founder and creator of Invigorate. Uh, yes, yeah, so I grew up in uh, South Jersey, outside Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, um, and I went to Rutgers uh, University in uh, New Jersey and studied biomedical engineering. Out of uh, college, I worked for J&J &J, uh, in their consumer division primarily, but also in pharmaceutical medical device. Um, and I took that knowledge and uh, what I thought was a, a void in the marketplace and created Invigorate. You know, I've always wanted to start my own company. It was just a matter of when I thought I had a product that I uh, truly believed in um, that would change consumers' lives and that it was worth the risk of uh, leaving my secure, you know, uh, great paying uh, job to do. And I also wanted to make that jump before, uh, you know, having too many other life commitments that might get in the way of, you know, running uh, uh, the day-to-day -day operations of a startup. So yeah, Dan being uh, 28, uh, he's ahead of the curve as far as uh, being a very young entrepreneur and, and being driven. This is it's amazing uh, what he's done and what he's doing and moving forward with this company. I think it's hard work, determination, um, and he's got it all. So I just, I'm, I'm excited to see where this product goes. The big differences between Invigorate and Johnson & Johnson uh, is that, you know, you really can see the fruits of your labor right in front of your eyes. Uh, whereas at J&J, &J, you know, you're, you're, you're a piece in a very big uh, machine and you're definitely providing value, but you really don't see the direct uh, value. You don't see the fruits of your, of your labor. Yeah, I think the South Bay is great. It's a very supportive uh, community. Um, it definitely is uh, entrepreneur friendly. Uh, specifically for Invigorate, um, you know, one of the reasons why I, you know, really chose this as a home base is really we're in the mecca of endurance sports. Um, you know, our product is developed, you know, for that recreational endurance athlete. He's doing it. You know, he's out there promoting the product every, at race events. He's in there getting getting the grind on and. You know, amazing guy you know it's a successful guy he's gonna be for being 20 years old and some people you could tell that want to be successful and he's one of them you know, he wants to change the world on with invigorate you know actually I signed up for my first marathon the Disney World Marathon in early of 2013 and I was gonna be running it in January of 2014 um, and I was just researching the nutrition you know when you're running a marathon it's you know four hour plus event and uh, nutrition is really important um, and I was just looking at the options out there from a hydration standpoint and I thought that there was a void in the market there was a need for a product um, in the recreational endurance space um, and, and there was an ingredient in my background that I, uh, I knew about and it's uh, beta alanine which helps keep up your muscle pH so essentially what that means is when you're walking you're doing any physical activity sometimes you feel that burning sensation in your muscles what that is is uh, it's your muscles are giving off hydrogen ions that are positively charged and it drops your pH so that's like what people would call lactic acid buildup beta alanine is the rate limiting factor to buffer that so it keeps your muscle pH up so really it extends endurance so I wanted to take that ingredient and formulate it into a beverage format and really create the ultimate endurance product funny you see you know the commercials uh, where they say Ford and Apple were all created in a garage well you know it's it's true uh, you know Invigorate is starting it started in a garage we're sitting in it right now um, but that's just the definition of a startup in my opinion I think that it's all about bootstrapping in a sense doing everything you know with uh, you know to, to make it through you know the first store that really took uh, the leap in, in faith in Invigorate was Fresh and Easy which was great because they're actually a local company based in El Segundo but yeah it was very rewarding you know seeing your product on a, a mass retailer shelf you know where thousands hundreds of thousands millions of consumers go right now we're essentially in what I would call scale mode uh, so we're really trying to build out our availability uh, pillar and, and get more retail distribution um, and you know we secured you know Gelson's and Bristol Farms and we're now going into the largest the largest grocery retailer in all of Texas HEB um, and it's uh, it's fun it's 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 stressful it's fun it's scary uh, it's a little bit of everything because you know, as you go, your cash flow becomes a greater need. Um, but at the end of the day, you know, you have to, you build your business and that's the way to get out to more consumers is being on more shelves.